There were two pitch inspections before the referee finally gave the go-ahead to this game with freezing fog and ice at East End Park. The Aberdeen management weren't happy, but on it went. And Aberdeen had the first real chance. Alex De Rocco cutting out a slack Ian Ferguson pass, but his shot was saved. It was Dunfermline, though, who opened the scoring. Stevie Crawford emerged through the fog to beat the offside trap and coolly slotted it past goalkeeper Ryan Essen. It was Crawford's second goal in two games. His goal last week, his first in two and a half months. The Dons, though, equalised through David Rowson. Ariel Stavrum set him up. Rowson gave Rutenbeek no chance with his low drive. The Aberdeen fans struggled to see it, but Rowson had levelled the match. And then Aberdeen took the lead just before the break. Their free kick straight from the training ground as Andy Dow made the space to squeeze home past the keeper. A well-worked free kick between Young and Dow, especially in the conditions, and Aberdeen were in front. But within a minute of the restart, Dunfermline grabbed the equaliser. Yusef Rossi was stopped once, then unleashed a tremendous low curling shot that flew just inside the post. A superb strike by the Moroccan international, his first goal for the club, and game on at 2-2. That boosted the confidence of the home side. Five minutes later, they were back in front. Marius Dijkhausen headed down for Barry Nicholson, who slammed the ball into the top right-hand corner. A great comeback by Dunfermline, their third consecutive home win, and they moved to seventh in the table.